for those people who are seasonal skiers, you know, they're not professional, they're not, they're not following the snow around the world, you got to condition yourself to get out there. You can't just like show up and put the skis on and, you know, how do you prepare yourself to go skiing? And don't start with the bar and the drinking. No. Uh, it's really no joke getting ready for skiing. If you, if you want to enjoy your ski vacation, put in at least, you know, six weeks is ideal. Three weeks would help. At the gym. At the gym. So, and there's two types of exercises you want to do. You want to do conditioning and getting in shape exercises and also injury prevention. So, conditioning... I have a great injury prevention exercise. Yes. Don't ski. Okay, go ahead. Um, actually, I have a great one. What? You want to do any exercise that works on your hamstrings and glutes. So, doing um, squats, doing lunges, doing split squats. Because you're, you're going to be doing that when you go down the hill. Yeah, that, the number one injury is ACL. That's in your knee. It's an ACL tear, which I did when I was 16. I've done it too, playing baseball. It's yeah. not fun. Oh, pain. I heard that pop and I knew exactly what it was. Yeah. yeah. Um, so you, you want to do anything that uh, strengthens your hamstrings and glutes to prevent ACL injuries. Also, um, deep uh, core exercises for your back. So planks, you know, that's your deep abdomen muscle and that helps protect your back. Um, and then in terms of conditioning, getting in shape, an easy one that I always do is you run on the treadmill uphill. You turn up the incline, run uphill. Or something that the ski team guys run do. Run or walk? I run. Wow. Um, but I'm talking, you know, you just... But you see, what I do on the trip, I, I get up to like 9 or 10 degrees, which is pretty high. That is very high. Right, but I'm only doing it at 3.4 miles an hour. So I'm walking, 3.4 miles an hour is pretty fast. When you think about it. And you're walking, at an uncle, and you can do that for 45 minutes, and you're okay. Yeah. That, I mean, that's good. But what you should really do... Oh, please, what? ...is you should turn that baby up to 15 degrees, get on it backwards, and get in a tuck, and you go up it backwards for 30 seconds five times, and you take a break of 30 seconds in between. And that's a really good exercise for uh, your quads. That's what the ski team guys do. You know, if I did that, I wouldn't even have to ski. I'd be in orthopedic surgery. No... Are you sure? Let's try it. Okay. Okay.